Thanks for watching. We appreciate you. Please, please subscribe. Miss Fogg, age 45, murdered December 25th, 2022, in Hampton, Virginia. Christmas Day, D. Shane. This is domestic violence. Woman dead and suspected Hampton homicide. Husband sought. Husband now wanted and wife's. Hampton Christmas Day murder. May this man pay finally. May he pay life in prison without parole or even the death penalty. And hopefully it won't take 10 years to give it to him. This is said. We hate crime. We hope you do too. This is a tribute to try to show, to show honor and respect to Miss Fogg and to her family and friends. News feed photos follows. God bless you, Miss Fogg. God bless your soul and definitely God bless your family and friends. Damn. Information on the man wanted as a person of interest in the killing of a Hampton woman. Police want to talk to Lamont Lewis, Tavona Fogg's husband. Tonight, we're learning more about some of Lewis's criminal past. Then your side's Haley Mylon continues to follow this story for us tonight. Haley. Well, Tom, Tavana Fogg's killer is still on the loose more than 48 hours later. Hampton Police spokesman Ernie Williams tells me he would still like to talk to her husband, Lamont Lee Lewis. Fogg's family members tell me that his behavior and criminal past are highly disturbing. She was like, he beat me like and put me in a little, I was like, oh my God. I said, you need to leave him alone and don't mess with him anymore. I don't know what happened for him to come back, but it was crazy. Tiana Graham recalling a conversation with her cousin, Tivana, a month ago. Family members say Tivana crawled into the hospital and collapsed after her husband allegedly beat her. But Tivana didn't want to press charges. Now the family is grieving as the unthinkable happened on Christmas Day. Tivana's daughter says she found her with a gunshot wound to her chest. They haven't been able to get in touch with Lewis. Family members say Lewis's criminal history is alarming. He's due in court in Hampton next month for drug possession charges. In July of 2018, he was sentenced to 10 years with seven years suspended, also for drug-related charges. And in 2001, he was charged with murdering a man in Hampton. Those charges were null prost. According to a published report at the time, prosecutors couldn't reach a key witness. Over the years, he's racked up dozens of charges across Hampton Roads. Graham and her family are urging Lewis to come forward to police with what he knows about what happened. You don't want to get caught by nobody else. That's all I'm going to say. You need to turn yourself in because if you get caught by somebody else, it's, it's, it's over with. You just do the right thing. That's all I say. 
The family plans to hold a candlelit vigil for fog tomorrow night in Hampton. I'll have information over on wavy.com about that. And if you know anything that can help police, call the crime line. I'm Haley Mylon, 10 on your side. Thanks for watching. We appreciate you. Please, please subscribe.